here with Jenna Stevens as Stanton gets the championship here in the Girls' Corner Conference Tournament. Jenna, how's it feel to be a champion? It feels amazing. We knew we would have to work for it, and we did. We were prepared tonight. We knew it was going to be a tough battle, and we just ran with what we came in with tonight, and everybody was shooting the ball well. We were getting lots of steals. We really hit the boards hard tonight, and it just worked out really well for all of us. You got really going there offensively with a couple of threes. Is that some, a part of your game you kind of want to expand on? Sometimes, yeah. I would like to improve on it way more often and get more accurate. But in games like this, I take a if I'm feeling hot or if I'm open, just not forcing it. And defensively, you guys were solid all night going from zone back to man in a bunch of different ways. Is that something you worked on in such a short time period for this championship? Uh, yeah, it's a lot of our normal things. We're just a really tough defensive team, and we like to get steals and just intertwine with people and we all work so well together with communicating on defense and getting steals for each other. How do you feel like your team has kind of come together throughout this season to where they're at now as a champion? Um, it started out a little shaky. We have a lot of incoming freshmen that we had to work into the game, but really everybody's worked well together and it's worked out amazing. Now what's kind of your expectations now throughout the rest of the season? Uh, keep building on it. We know there's going to be some tough games, but as long as we work hard every day in practice, then we'll be just fine. Congrats on the win, Jenna. Thank you. With head coach Dave Snyder and a victory for Stanton and a championship victory at that. Coach, thoughts on a nice ball game? <clears throat> well, um, you know, it, it's just a matter of uh, playing our game, and that's what we did all night. We just played our game, and uh, it's worked for us for quite some time now. We're just going to keep playing our game, I guess. Yeah, and how difficult has that been to just kind of get into a rhythm? You started off slow this season, but now to look at, hey, we just won the quarter conference tournament. Yeah, um, uh, you know, I don't know. We, we've worked up to it. Um, you know, you, you, early on we had some people missing practice and that sort of thing. And, uh, you know, at times we still are a little out of kilter once in a while with our sets. And uh, we, we continue to refine and get better. And we need to. Yeah, absolutely. So what's kind of your expectations now moving on to the season? What are some things to improve upon? Uh, oh, well, expectation-wise, is number one, we want to finish up on our goals. And this was one of our big goals. Uh, we still would want to win the uh, conference outright, and, and that's a big goal of ours. And we got some big games coming down the stretch. Uh, with that, fortunately, they're all at home, uh, so uh, that, that's a benefit. Uh, but then just getting better and uh, moving on to districts, and we want to do, go deep into districts and, and you know get the ultimate prize there. How does winning a midseason tournament like this help you into the postseason? Oh, uh, you know, just uh, the jitters in a game like this. I, I, I have the jitters, I, I'll admit, you know, and, and you know they do. Uh, and you got to get through that nervousness. And, and so the more times you're in this situation, uh, the quicker you get out of that and you move on and play your game. Congrats on the championship, Coach, and good luck the rest of the season. Thank you very much.